Like there were so many questions as I was going through this confirmation process of like, even why do we even need NASA? You know, now that we have great, you know, commercial space companies like SpaceX and, and Jeff Bezos funding Blue Origin, it was like, what are we talking about here? Of course we still need NASA. And like, you don't think back in the 1960s that we didn't have dependencies on Grumman and other major aerospace manufacturers. Of course we do. The issue is just, we need to recalibrate from time to time of what we're working on versus what they're working on. And right now you're at this interesting point in time where we're working on big heavy lift rockets while commercial industry is capable of doing it. Why are we doing that? Like we should recalibrate to what they can't work on that doesn't have a business case or or any good commercial use case. And that's why like nuclear electric propulsion was so important. And and the, and the reason why um, it should be a government program is because you're talking about like highly enriched uranium here um, and launching nuclear reactors of which for for corporations to get, you know, like indemnity waivers to it is going to be a very long and painful process. Even transporting highly enriched uranium uh, is a is a nightmare. It's like the exact kind of thing that we are paying as taxpayers the government to solve because the applications for it are, are numerous. And it's just, again, in the direction of goodness.